Hey everybody, Charlie and I are two here, and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Over the last few episodes, we've made it back to the mainland here. We've found out that uh, Arthur's not doing so well. You can kind of see it in his eyes there, they're red. He's got tuberculosis. Doesn't look too good for him. Uh, we need to move our camp again. Well, we did move our camp again. We moved it to where the Hills Have Eyes territory is. And I believe uh, Dutch is losing it. We also rescued John Marston, so we have him back in the camp. And let's continue and see what's going on. All right. So our dead eye is weak, so let's go have a quick nap. And then we're going to figure out what we're going to do next. I think our tent is right over here. I may also want to check the ledger and see if we can upgrade anymore, although I don't think we can. <laughs> What's Jack talking about? Stopped all that silly business. I think I'm okay. Well, that's Back up a little bit. You're a little close. How? I don't know. I met a Catholic lady, a nun, and we prayed, and it was lifted. The curse was lifted. Good. I can't believe it. Really, I can't. All those years I wasted. Well, I'm glad to hear you're doing all right. You got a little close to me, though. I don't want to give you. Give you a TV. I was trying to figure out what Jack was talking about here. But uh, your story was more important, I guess. So we're going to um, sleep. And we'll sleep until morning. We'll sleep 15 hours. Alright, so Dutch keeps telling us last score. Need to get a bunch of money. Yes, you can overwrite the saves. But every score seems to be the last score, and it just keeps getting worse and worse and worse. Our main protagonist here doesn't seem too long for this world with TB either. I don't, I don't understand the end game with that. But uh, let's see what we can do here. Susan, oh. someone smashed the box. What box? box. We'd had that for so many years. Why did they smash it? Well, I don't know. Look at this place. All divided. Everyone anxious and at each other's throats. I'm heartbroken. Yeah, me too. Me too. Oh, no mission? That was it? Okay, somebody smashed the money box. We need to go to... Not here. We need to go to Annisburg and see Ilm. Micah. I don't like Micah. Maybe we can cut through here and not have to go all the way down here and back, but we'll see. Let's grab a horse. I don't like Micah. He's a loose cannon. He seems to be in it for himself. And I think he's egging Dutch on for what gain? Eh, it could be power struggle. It could be he just likes chaos. He doesn't seem to have the same morals that probably the majority of us in this quote-unquote gang seem to have. All right, let's look at uh, let's look at our weapons once we get out of camp here. I'm assuming this hill is the exit of camp. Yep, we can run now. All right, so we want the carbine and we want the rolling block, right? The rare rolling block. Tons of ammo. We haven't had to buy any ammo so far. Uh, I want the carbine to be the gun that we pull out, so I'll pull it out. I hit tab, put it away. A letter has arrived for you. Return to camp to read this. All right, well. Uh oh. Just, just go. Nope, they're gonna kick me off. All right, he'll still have eyes.
Ah, uh, tree got him. Is there any more? It seems to be just this one. Is he shooting? Ooh. Alright. Well, that didn't go too badly. I wasted some dead eye. Drop carbine for a worn double barrel. No, I don't want that. Let's loot. I got a little bit of money on them. Might as well loot them. At least make this worth our troubles. Try to get some of our ammo back. A couple bucks here and there. Alright, so I hope we have some more um, variety in missions. I like the uh, balloon mission. That was pretty cool. I was absolutely terrified of the gator mission, but it was fun. I will admit that. And definitely the most memorable of all the missions so far. Go to any gunsmith to buy the bandolier and gun belt. Okay. Um, so hopefully we have a little more variety other than, hey, go here and shoot these people. Because, to be honest, that gets... Uh, why would I want to pick him up? It gets a little uh, old at times. So I like having uh, more variety. Definitely interesting. So hopefully some of these missions coming up will be yeah. pretty interesting. I guess the horse didn't like running over the dead body. I'm sorry, horse. All right, off to Annisburg. Uh, while we're there, we're going to check the local uh, gunsmith. I think new weapons have become available, so we may want to spend some of our money and upgrade. It seems that a good repeater is our bread and butter. It seems to uh, cover most situations where there are multiple enemies to shoot that are fairly close. Yeah. Now I think we can just cut down here. Can we do this without killing our horse? Probably not. So we're not going to do that. Uh, it said something about a bandolier and gun belt. Now, I've already bought a bandolier and gun belt, so maybe there are better ones to buy. So we'll check that out as well. And we'll just peruse the stores. Um, Annisburg is the newest of the uh, settlements that we've been able to access. So maybe it has some uh, nicer things to procure. Nope, nope, nope. I don't see how you could ever complete this game in a timely manner if you did every one of these little side uh, events that just seem to populate around, around your course here. Train. Don't see a train. Okay. So this is Annisburg. It is a mining town. We are wanted, dead, or alive here? When did that happen? Is that because we rescued John? It probably is. So let's go ahead and pay off our bounty. Hopefully it doesn't take all of our money. Everyone, train will be here soon. Uh, Hello oh. there, pleased to see you. Yeah, can we pay our bounty with you? Yeah. If you wouldn't mind coughing in your sleeve, sir, I really can't afford to get sick again this month. Why don't you just do your job? Uh, of course, sir, sorry. It's just a polite request is all. There are no bounties here. Pay all. Free. Alright, now it said wanted dead or alive in Annisburg, but I have no bounty to pay. Oh, I hear the train. There it is. Okay, so there's a gunsmith here. Let's check that out. This must be your first time here? Yes. It is. Everything is here in the cabin. Just make a selection. And I can bring it out for you to inspect. Dude, how do you eat with that mustache? I hear there was a big shootout with the Murphy gang in the caves at Beaver Hollow. Yeah, it was me. I murdered them all. Okay, now let me see. All right, what do we got going on here? We want... Well, is there a better revolver than what we have? There's a cattleman, there's a double action. It's a volcanic pistol. Now, we saw that laying on um, it was laying on like a countertop in the in the island that we were at but we didn't grab it I don't think we need that Feel free right, carbine Evans 
Litchfield. It's still locked. We own the Lancaster. We can't buy the Litchfield. Okay. Springfield rifle. We have a rare rolling block. And we can't buy the Carcano. Okay, so really there's nothing here that that we want. Maybe this repeating shotgun? No. You know what? I'm good. I don't need any of this. Let's get out of here. Oh, it did say something about a bandolier. So let's check that out. Yeah, see, we have the bandolier and the holster. Is there anything else? Gun oil and belt. Yeah, we've already got all that stuff. Yeah, there's nothing else. Let's get out of here. Let's go do the mission. You have a good day, sir. It's here if you change your mind. Thank you. Very polite. Alright, let's go across the tracks. And uh, Micah should be over here somewhere. Now, I think we're going to go basically take over the mines as a way to get back. Was you followed? No. Was you followed? I said no. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what is your problem? What is your problem, partner? You don't, uh, you don't Does he look so like good. Buford Tannen to you? Back to Future 3? I'm fit as a fiddle. And I inside you, ain't. I'm just Micah's Buford 10. Micah reckons there's a rat. Oh, does he? On what evidence? He's only back a minute. Pinkerton show up. <laughs> We've been on the run since you two fools went crazy in Blackwater. We barely escaped with our lives in San Denis. Now we got a rat. Well, Molly clearly talked, but who else? Maybe we pushed things too hard. Yep. Whoa. Maybe time for folks like us has passed. Why don't y'all listen to Arthur rat. ever? We got sloppier than the town drunk, and they know who we are, and where we are, and what we're doing. The way I see it, the best thing we can do is let the week go. Move on, get our money, and start over. That ain't happening. Well, something's gotta happen, and fast. Otherwise, Cornwall. Them Pinkertons, they've got us panned in here. And ain't none of them stopping. Well, Cornwall's why we're here. Shall we, Dutch? Yeah, it's time to go. Let's head to the river. Okay, oh, what are we doing? Cornwall alone. He ain't. <laughs> we need money. But revenge? Now? Of course it's for money. Come on, Arthur. This better not be no stupid revenge mission, Dutch. It ain't worth it. Don't be ridiculous. Oh, Arthur. It's just a simple social call. <laughs> Dutch is insane, isn't he? He's just 100% insane. So, what are we going to say to him that needs to be said? He has been Watch out, Micah. There's, there's horse poop right he there. Okay. The that Hosea got killed. His sugar business is destroying the people of Guarma. This town, Arthur, it's his town. He bought it just to destroy these folks. His sugar, his oil, his law. These are wrongs that you can't write, Dutch. We wanted men. Oof, look at that. So why did you go for John against my wishes? I didn't want him hanged. Neither did I. Look at that oil. Deal, Arthur. What are you talking about? We want out, and Cornwall wants us to stop robbing him, and we all know his money is what's keeping the Pinkertons on our tail. He's America, Arthur, and I want out, and he, he won't let us go. This ain't making a lot of sense, does it? It's not. It will, son. It will. A deal, some noise, and then we're gone. So basically, you're going to ask for him just to kind of pay us a severance package. We'll no longer be his enemies. Oh, now we're hiding. So you're going to rob Cornwall directly. But you're going to call it a deal. And then you're going to complain that he's what's wrong with America. Which he is, but... You are too. <laughs> Arthur, I said get yourself hidden. How is this not hidden? 
How much more hidden do you want us? I had to hit Q to be hidden. Look, I can see Dutch right there. He's got a bright red shirt on. Or vest. Look at that. It's not very stealthy there, Dutch. I want to thank you for your hospitality, Mr. Cornwall. This was a business meeting, Mr. Milton. We are not friends. I have spent a considerable I thought we killed Mr. Milton. Agency, and still nothing. How do you make it out of the swamp? robs me and laughs at me. I asked for the best. I paid for the best. We are very close, Mr. Cornwall. I know you've heard this before. Can't, sir. Send a telegram to Goldberg in New York. Tell him I won't borrow it more than 3.2%. Sorry, no, I have heard it before. And get that army man to pay his portage charge. Yes, sir. We are doing all we can within the confines of the law. The law? I think we both know what you can do with your law. Find me Dutch Vanderlyn. Bring him here and leave the laws to them as need them. Good day, sir. I said Long good day, boss, sir. Work to do. Mr. Didsbury. Didsbury. Mr. Cornwall. Now listen up, Didsbury. What's all this about strikes? I bought into this mine because of mismanagement. And I intend to make it a success, no matter what the cost. It's the wages. Folk feel Folk that you... feel? Business doesn't give two figs about feelings, sir. Not two figs. It's a nonsense. Why don't you just kill him right here, Dutch? Houses, Perhaps there is a plague on your house already, Mr. Cornwall. What do you want, sir? I'm not quite sure just yet. Your impudence will be your undoing, sir. I'm undone already. Even my best friend here, he thinks I'm crazy. And like this poor fellow you are talking to, my feelings are hurt. You robbed me, sir. And you robbed him. Funny world. You show a criminal's grasp of sophistry, sir. I did no such thing. You kill. I kill. You rob. I rob. Only difference I can see is I choose whom I kill and rob and you destroy everything in your path. I've heard just about enough. I'll tell you what. You give me this ship, $10,000, and safe passage out of here, I'll let you live. <laughs> I'll do no such thing. <laughs> you sure? Good. I prefer it this way. Okay. Noise, Arthur. No boys. All right, well, we here now. All right. We just going to take the ship? Oh, you really didn't think Pinkertons would be here? You know, we just killed their... Where's my... All right. I don't know why my carbine's here now, but I got a carbine. Okay, out of dead eye juice. The guy over here. Shoot him in the heart. Shoot him in the heart. Oh my goodness. Why don't we just take the ship like you said? Who are we fighting? This guy? Come on, Dutch, you're not even hiding behind anything. He's dead. Ooh, there's one up here. I'm totally missed, but whatever. Oh, man, I'm getting hit. They're shooting from that building. Oh, my goodness. Y'all saw that? Oh, again, who's shooting me now? You are. Just enough dead eye juice. That's Micah. I found something interesting. Uh, you want to help us? Come on down there. Swing or something. Come on, this way. Up the uh, I'm coming. I'm coming. Stay with me, Can I reload? I'm already reloaded. I'm trying to stay with you. Arthur, come on. Hush. Men are all over the place. You think? This is his town. Oh 
How many people are we going to kill? I'm trying, you crazy person. Freaking Micah. This is cool, though. Run, 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 run. Okay. Oh, that's Micah. Probably should shoot him and Dutch. You guys are just insane. Oh my goodness, this is bad. Alright, got a couple more. Who's shooting? That guy. And that guy. And that guy. Come on. We can take the horses from that coach. Alright, let's do it. Let's take the horses. Let's go. Let me guess, I gotta shoot people well, while riding away on the horse. Talking it out. Boys, lost your minds. Oh, I felt a lot of guilt in this life, Arthur. I've killed too often and poorly, but not this time, son. Come on! Let's go. Okay. Of course they are. We've done this a lot. Go into a place, we shoot a guy, we run away. He's dead. Oh, we're going off road. Where? Ah! Can't aim at him. Alright, I just... My horse ran into a tree. I'm gonna fail the mission. Where's my horse? Get off. Don't run into a tree. Yeah, I'm trying to return to Dutch. Come on, go, 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 go. Go faster, horse. Alright, well, I guess we didn't fail yet. Got a guy to shoot here. There's no dead eye. Look out, fellas. They're still coming. Shoot the master. Okay, good shot, Micah. Can we? Now, maybe. All right. Uh, looks like we did it. Well, Cornwall's dead. Uh, does that help us? Call. Oh, don't play dumb and superior at the same time, Morgan. We all knew sooner or later Cornwall had to go. Let me see them papers. It's more attention we don't need. Feels like the whole world's closing in on us. Dutch, it won't be long before they find where we're hiding out now. Especially as we ain't exactly hiding out. We just need a distraction. Buy us some time. It looks like Mr. Cornwall's company has signed a railroad contract with the army. And they're also moving dynamite down from, well, the Annisburg mines to San Denis to resell. And there's bonds at his oil factory. Maybe there's a way to get them off our back and get the money that we need. Micah, you look into this dynamite. Take Bill, I guess, Arthur. You go too. We are gonna need a lot of it. And Mike, we need to talk. Figure out some things. Of course, boss. Figure out what? The plan. Getting out of here. Nothing's changed. It hasn't, huh? There's an old house west of Van Horn. Meet me there when you can, Black Lung. Let's split up. We'll meet up back at camp. Calling yeah. us Black Lung, huh? This is crazy. 
Yeah, Arthur. It is absolutely freaking crazy. So now we've got, what? We gotta get dynamite, we gotta check on this army thing, and then he wants to get bonds from his... Where's my horse? From his uh, factory. My horse is right around the bend. Okay, let's go get on my horse. Stamina's level 8. Alright, get on Mr. Ed here. And I'm assuming those missions both start from the camp. One does. R.S. Reverend Swanson wants something. And then Micah. So let's hit... Let's go to the camp. See what the Reverend wants. Then we'll head down and do Micah's mission. Where I guess we're still in dynamite, which doesn't sound like a fun thing to try to steal while we're getting shot at, but, you know, we've done worse things. What was that? Okay, no. You stay there. I wonder what Reverend Swanson wants us to do. You think it has something to do with uh, that lady friend he's met? Probably, right? Yeah, our camp really isn't that hidden. It's just right up here off of the river. Uh, where do we put the horses? Hello. How are you doing? doing all right. Horses are over here. Let me hitch on up. There we go. Hitch horse. Uncle, what's up? I'm going to go talk to Reverend. He's got a mission. He doesn't look so good. Reverend Swanson. <coughs> Reverend? You okay, Mr. Morgan? I don't know, Reverend. These are challenging times for all of us. Yes. Very challenging. You don't seem yourself, somehow. I, I've always felt... I've left the morphine, sir. Arthur, I'm Reverend Swanson, would you excuse us a minute? Of course. New York. Okay, so it turned into Dutch we mission. We're going to go to New York. Now, they have been chasing New York. south and east and west. We're going to get a boat. We're going to get on a river, and we're going to go north. New York. Then Tahiti, the Fiji Islands, or this place, New Guinea, dancing girls, freedom. But first, we have to make a whole lot of smoke, a whole lot of commotion. And then we disappear. We need more commotion? One score and one whole hell of a lot of noise. We ain't so good at doing scores anymore, Dutch. Are you feeling all right, Arthur? Sure, I'm fine. Pardon me for interrupting. Uh-oh. Brought a friend, Arthur. Charles, oh, what you got for us? Dutch. This is Eagle Flies. His father is a great chief. Charles and I, we... Uh, pretended to be mercenaries. Did me a great favor. Dutch Vanderland. How do you do? Not well, sir. Well, I am sorry to hear that. How's your father? Father is confused. Wisdom with weakness. His people, my people, we've suffered too much, been lied to too much. Now they've taken our horses. Who? The infantry division posted at Fort Wallace. Why? Colonel Favors is a liar and a murderer. His people won't stop until we're all dead. Without horses, we cannot hunt. Without hunting, we will starve. This is another act of war. I see that. The men have helped me before, and I have money. Put your money away. Son. What do you think, Charles? You know, I told your father I will not fight over some horses. But I made no such promise. Come along. Yeah. Arthur, we must go with them. To try to stop things from getting out of hand. I guess. Yeah. We're going to start a conflict that's going to end up with his people getting killed. We can get them more horses. I know. 
I understand Eagle Flies is angry, but I don't see how this will help anything. I don't either. Especially not with Dutch whipping him up into a frenzy. Got enough folks coming after us without adding an army to the list. You're going to let these bastards walk all over you? No, you're not. This is all that's wrong with this world. See, Dutch just wants to use him. Come on, girl. Okay, young man, lead the way. Uh, do I got anything that will heal Deadeye? Damages it slightly. Um, but my core is gone, right? Fully restores everything. Open mural time. Yeah, let's drink that. If my horse can figure out how to get around these hitching posts, we'll be good. What will be, will be. Anyway, son, tell me about this Colonel Favor. Boom. All right, we're going to continue this next episode. Uh, thanks for watching. If you enjoy my content, please consider to like, a comment, and or subscribe. Stay tuned for the next episode. We'll continue this, and we'll see you then. Bye-bye.